Hey everybody, we're at my mother's house today, and I've got Zane up on the roof, sweeping off and cleaning gutters out, sweeping the roof off. Finley's up here somewhere. There's Finley. We are at my mother's, as I said. This is the house that built me, my brother, and my sister. We're doing a little yard work today. It's Saturday. It's a beautiful day. Beautiful bluebird sky up there. Look at that. A few clouds. Some years ago, my mother planted all these plants after I told her not to put these particular plants here. Azaleas, crepe myrtles, more azaleas. And that ligustrum down there has been cut down numerous times in my lifetime. It's been here for as long as I can remember. However, these azaleas, azaleas and the crepe myrtles were not. Those are not very good house-friendly plants as far as putting them close to the foundation. This is uh, an azalea, and it's the indica. And look at it by the big leaves. This plant will get huge. That azalea right there has been growing in that spot. Also for as long as I can remember. But we're going to prune these back today. And then later on in the winter, I'm going to dig them up and move them. Zane, you guys okay up there? They're almost done. Got a lot of stuff to do here. Wrecking. You want to say anything? No. <laughs> So anyway, that's what we're doing right now. We're gonna start pruning. I've already pruned this tree here, this oak tree. We just got all kinds of things going today. So hopefully it's gonna look nicer when we leave. Working with this boy right here. Let's see if I can get him to look at the camera. <laughs> he has a dude just mad at me. He was wanting to do the whole roof today. We're going to do it in sections as we work around in the yard takes 10 minutes and then we got to clean that, that part up at the backyard we're going to get back there eventually hear him watch this kick <laughs> then we got anything you want to say while we're cleaning up um, he's hot all right we'll return this is probably not uh, OSHA approved, but I was trying to show Finley how to use the garbage bag. Finley, you in there? And uh, finally got some good garbage bags to uh, pick up this this leaf litter. Let's see what's in here. Oh my goodness! Look at that. Just crazy kids. All right, we've got these holly leaves that we're le uh, leaking up, uh, raking up. Yeah, raking, not leaking. Raking, not leaking. These are fun leaves. And little points on the leaf edges that poke you. Right, Zane? They poke, right? Ow! See? <laughs> we had some garbage bags earlier that um, 
Matter of fact, this this pile of leaves has been here for a while. This this holly has already shed its leaves for the season. Now the berries are forming, and that's always nice to have right at the doorway. Trees that produce berries and cones shouldn't be at your doorway, but it is. I remember one time um, my dad told us a story when they first moved here. He was trying to cut this tree down, which wasn't very big then. It probably was about this big, if it was even that big. And he said, had not my mother gotten home in time, the tree would have been taken down. And now check this tree out. It's huge. I believe it's Ilex opaca. It's an American holly. <laughs> this tree has saved me from many a butt whooping from my older brother when we were younger. Look at this. I've climbed this tree. This was my escape route many a time. I used to climb over and get onto the roof and make my great escape. <laughs> but my brother and I, we get along now. But I think back in the day when I was younger, I used to really irritate him, as most younger brothers do. Yeah, he's in Germany now. He and his family are. If y'all watching this video, we want to say hey. You want to say hey to your cousins? You want to be on camera? No. That's my mom. She don't want to be on camera. Where did Finley go? Finley, you want to say hey to your cousins in case they watch this video? Hey, Uncle Tim. Hey, Uncle Julie. Hey, Uncle hey. Tim. Hey, Uncle hey. Junior. Hey. Uncle Junior. I said Uncle Junior. <laughs> Aunt Julie. All right. We'll be back. In a minute, I'm going to try to let you use that saw, okay? I'm going to try to cut another one of these limbs down. See if you can handle it. Mm -hmm. All right. I can handle it. Well, we'll see. We'll get something else here in a little while and let you try it too. Right there, do what you're doing. Take the camera to the roof. What you gonna do on the roof? It would be cool if we could like just set this up on the roof and the roof was like really cool and it wouldn't break. And then there was like a pool under here and we could like just ride these things into the pool. Yeah. Like that, it couldn't break and there was like a pool right here and you could just ride and then jump into the pool. And Don't get that. <laughs> what? What you're saying? I have no idea what Some kind of ride like at the Great Wolf Lodge into the pool but on top of the house. Is that right? Didn't you used to jump off a trampoline into the pool? No, I never do stuff like that. But who, didn't you say that? Pruning this coming along nicely. Looking better down on the ground. There's Finley down there hiding like a little Sasquatch. And there's Siley down here. Siley's joined us. What's up, Silas? Just enjoying the day. Ooh, all right, we are moving on along here. <clears throat> I am now by myself in this endeavor. The children that you saw earlier in this video have disappeared. Work is a four letter word. Not many people like it, especially children. Whew. It's coming on along. Earlier, in this video, when I first got here, this was much bushier, and I've been pruning. I'm gonna get all the way back down to that corner there. Something cool about azaleas. This limb had gotten pressed against the ground, and it propagated roots, so I could snip this right here 
and take these roots and plant it and have a whole nother azalea bush. These things are prolific. Is that the word? Growers? Man, these things will grow. I love azaleas. But wow, do they grow. Do they grow. Coming along here. Whoo. Yard work is tough. Ugh. Still have to this corner. The sun's not making that screen get washed out with the sunlight. Broke my shovel. I had this shovel for quite a few years and started breaking right here. It actually popped out a few minutes ago and I forced it back in but it's breaking now when I put any type of any amount of force on it. It's been a good shovel. I have to get me a new shovel now. Replace my tools. Alright, it's coming along. All right, made a lot of progress here. Got Zane. He's come back out joining me. He is cleaning this ivy. Yes, yeah, poison. Uh, <laughs> I think that is called Boston ivy. I'm not sure. This ivy has been here for as long as I can remember. My dad had planted it along that hillside out there. And it died off. So... That's been some years ago, but somehow it propagated itself here, and it has been growing here for some years now, but we're cleaning it up. My mom doesn't like it against the house. I don't blame her. It's unsightly. But look at our progress. My help's back out here. You can see the front of this house. Later on in the winter, I'm going to come up and dig up these bushes, and we're going to relocate them in the area where they're won't outgrow. Those bushes are just too big. Those azaleas and crepe myrtles and this this is a ligustrum here. Smooth leaf and then there was pivot hedge ligustrum which just grows like weeds. But we're going to move them and we're going to put some plants here that's more friendly for the side of her house or front of her house. Let me show you guys something here. I was cutting this dogwood tree here. I made my cut here on this collar and I came underneath and made an undercut or I think it's called a kerf cut so when the cuts made this will come off and it won't tear or damage any of this down this way so progress is being made all right well I cut it off it's fairly clean cut a lot of hormones in here and eventually this will heal over all right well we got everything done Cut back, raked up, broke some tools, made some new rakes and shovels. Big bag of leaves, leaves and limbs, and everything's looking nicer. Trimmed up that, got the gutters cleaned and. One of the little valleys up there on the roof got it cleaned out. Look at all this stuff we trimmed. That's a load of debris. So now it's time to go home and relax and enjoy the rest of our Saturday. Right, Sally? Mm -hmm. Ah, he's my little character. I well, hope everyone has a good weekend. It's been a good Saturday. Been productive. We um got a lot of work ahead of us for the fall, but that's good. Get everything cleaned up. Look at getting it nicely. Uh, looking nice around here. So you can see down through there. In the beginning of the video, you can look at it and see how thick that was. And like I said, during the winter, <clears throat> I'm going to get in here and dig these azaleas and the crepe myrtles up. I'm going to relocate them to an area that's more suitable for their sizes. Or size. All right, everybody. Y'all have a good weekend. We'll see you.